morning, baby is back. I know I'm gonna explain a lot. Hold on, turn up the music. <laughs> okay, sorry, it's playing my Alexa, but I'm back. The last vlog you saw were my Mexico vlogs, and I'm back. I took like a week off of vlogging because I had to like upload those videos. So if I started vlogging when I got back today, you'd only be seeing like Monday's vlog, and you'd be like, "Bitch, this is a week old." So today's Saturday. I'm, I got my period, and my skin broke out so badly. So like, let's not drag. My skin is doing so well, and everyone's commenting, "Your skin is so clear. You look so good." And I was like, "Thanks, guys." And then I got my period, and. I, my skin breaks out like this every time of my period and it's just so bad so also my skin my face is paler than my body because I got a spray tan last night and yeah a little reflection this past week this past week March energy is a little rough so if you're feeling a little all over the place and etc that's why I had kind of like an emotional week like I just was like I'm a Gemini too so if you're a Gemini you kind of know like it was just like I was like feeling weird sometimes and like eh but today I woke up I went to bed I, got a, I went to class yesterday came home Sorry, like, ugh, I just hate when my skin's breaking out, but it's like, what can I do? You know, can't control it, so I gotta accept it. Hi, bun! Coco is here. Um, so I went, to, I went to class, and I came home, got a spray tan, I went to bed at 9, and then I woke up this morning at 7. I went to go work out. I had the most intense spin class of my life. I'd be like, I go to the class, like, almost every day, and it was so intense. Like, I literally almost cried at the end because she kept pushing so hard, and I couldn't, like, breathe. And also, it was almost like fasted cardio because I didn't eat before because I literally have no groceries. I get groceries. Um, but yeah, I was like really intense and like at the end I was like couldn't even breathe and I was like You know, you feel like you're about to like throw up because you're so like, I don't know It's one of those workouts, but it's good I feel so energized and it reminds me that I need to make sure I wake up early to go to this spin class This 8 a.m. spin class on Saturday because it's like it sets my day so good Like I woke up and I felt f glowing fine Um, also my mom did a uh, distant Reiki on me, Reiki healing She does that, she offers that service too if I, I've talked about it before in my Mexico vlogs. My mom does like oracle readings, tarot readings. I, one of you just had a reading and she said it, she just, like, told me that it went really well. So I'm really glad that you guys are liking it, who are, who are doing it. She's like, if you think I'm like spiritually like lit, like she's just like a master. And yeah, so she did distant Reiki on me just to clear out like my energy and look, look at my chakras. And it, I feel so much better. And yeah, you can research Reiki healing and leave like an article to it. But she does that too, so she's awesome and she's like uh, level 3 certified and everything. So yeah, what am I going to do right now? I'm about to eat at the Masai Bowl. I'm going to get ready, I'm going to film a few videos, and then I need to go... This sounds so extra, but I need to go to Gucci. So I have to go... Basically I bought Shane this Gucci bracelet for like an occasion, and then like it was too small, so I returned it. And then when I was in Chicago, I was at the Gucci store there, and the woman told me it was the biggest size, which is like, I knew what it was, and I knew the biggest size would fit, but it wasn't the biggest size. It was one under and it was too small and today's literally the last day I can return it or like try to see if they have a different size or like I already planned out a different gift because I was like oh my god like I'm not I like feel like it's like a sign I should not get this bracelet and Shane was like honestly like get me something else like it's totally fine. It's so super cute though but yeah I don't know so I need to go return today's literally the last day I can do it. So I'm gonna go with Ollie to we're gonna go to Rodeo. Um I'm on Rodeo for the day, you know what I'm saying? Uh so we're gonna go to Whole Foods and then we're gonna go to Rodeo to return it and that the that's like a day that's already right there like eight hours of my day like from now to then and then later tonight i'm hanging out with stella i think we might go to a mexican restaurant and then because we love fresh guacamole and then we'll just hang out in the jacuzzi i have like a jacuzzi in my apartment and just like chill and relax that's kind of my day i've had like a, like i said a kind of a stressful week it's just like really emotional week i don't know i was just like not feeling my best i couldn't vlog like i'm not even gonna lie i was just it was really hard like i just wasn't feeling good i was really overwhelmed with a lot of stuff like i do try to balance everything but i was just really overwhelmed and i was just feeling like very i don't know the energy was like i was just not feel good i'm so blessed and so grateful that i feel so good today and that my mom could do the reiki for me and oh my god i have so many cool new things to show you i'm about to do my makeup right now but i want to show you something really cool before i begin I'm on Rodeo for the day. So basically, I um, love when I'm really messy. I got these hot rollers. My friend Allie, Allie said Dallas on YouTube, she got like teeth. I don't know if these are the same ones that she got, but she had T3 hot rollers and I was texting her about it. She said she loves them. Hi, Coco. Um, and so I decided to try them out because like after I get a blowout the next three days I like I kind of I, I, I usually just curl my hair with this wand But like sometimes I, w I feel like this would be so much easier especially for class if I could like wake up put these hot rollers in while I do my makeup only 20 minutes and then um What's it called and then like have like fresh blowout looking hair because it like basically it gives you like this big open waves It's kind of just want that like big open blowout like a Cosmo, but super open looking so I'm gonna try to put them in right now 
So like I don't know where to put this. I'm gonna try to put them in. I don't know if it's gonna, it's gonna be tall enough to. This is like not stable enough to do this. I don't know. This is like really low. I know. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna try to put them in right now. Coco's like interested. I know this like might be a really weird angle or whatever. In the clip, I'm just trying to know, see like where I could get a good angle for this. I just like don't know. This is like very high up. I mean, this is as good as it's gonna get. I can do like this. Oh my gosh. Also, my apartment, like my dryer, like stop using dryer. I had to have like maintenance come fix that, and then, and then like one of my blinds broke, and like on top of like I was so stressed, so like, not in a good mood. All these things kept happening, and I literally like I remember when I pulled my blind and it broke. I literally started bawling my eyes out. I, it was just like I had I had like forty different things to do for school, so many video things. I was still like unpacking. I was just like, oh, I was like so, oh gosh, I don't want to talk about it, guys, but, so if you're feeling like that, like, just know you can get out of it, like, literally, like, I would meditate three times a day just to try to, like, get my mind off of it, everything, and just, like, heal myself, and, yeah, I don't know, I did cards for myself and everything, so, it, it comes with, like, clips, it comes with, like, this, I, I use this clip normally for my hair, I don't know how to put them in ever, I've never done hot rollers in my entire life, so, um, I hope we're not, like, having some high expectations right now for me, because I've literally, like, never done this. I don't know if they're heating up. Are they heating up? Do you have to click on or something? Am I? I love not no, like. Okay, so like they sit on this tray and they heat up on the tray. I think that they light up like red right here when they're done. I'll link these down below. Oh, there's a on button. I pressed it. It's right there. Um, I got them off of Amazon, so I'll link those if you want. Not sponsored. Wish it was. So then I'm gonna like part my hair. I've literally never done this. Okay, when Coco wants to be the star of the show, I'm just brushing my hair with the round brush which is not the smartest idea but whatever i also need to get my extensions retaped they're like falling out but it's so frustrating i'm like so pissed i ordered these extensions from bombay on monday and i overnighted them and it's saturday and i still haven't got them and it's really frustrating because i had an appointment with my girl for tomorrow because these extensions like had them for like a year so i want to get new ones because they're kind of getting like you can see when they're getting like thinned out and i have photos i can tell and i want it like toned and like this brown i might a lot of you guys I'm going to show you some photos of my hair with super blonde. I really like it. I might do it for the summer later after Venus Retrograde. Right now is Venus Retrograde. You can research it. I'll try to leave an article. You shouldn't do like, you shouldn't change your appearance like get filler or like color your hair new. You can do like touch-ups, but you shouldn't do like anything wild and new. So anyway, I don't know why I'm going off on this tangent, but basically I'm supposed to have them to like literally on Tuesday or Wednesday. I thought by the, I definitely have them by Sunday. And they still haven't come and I'm so pissed. Like I emailed them. So like I'm not a fan. Like I don't, I would not recommend ordering from them because it's just like this and I paid like extra to have them overnight and it's just frustrating and they weren't on back order or anything and yeah so like now I can move my appointment and cancel it and that's like I felt so bad because like putting extensions and doing all that was like 10 hours of her day so she like I cleared like her whole Sunday schedule so anyway like that on top of everything was happening to like like this week you know those weeks where nothing works out and you're just like bitch what the fuck do you mean so yeah but um it's fine. So that's why my extensions like are like so loose because like from the, from the trip my hair would be socking, socking, so soaking wet and then I wouldn't blow dry obviously because I'd be on the beach which would pull the glue down. Okay, are they hot yet? I'm scared. I don't know how to put them in. Are they going to be like really hot? Um, so I'm going to try to catch you up in my life. Like, you know, so much obviously happened this week but not, nothing. Like, that's basically it. Summer, that's why, that's why my hair is like this color is... This is my natural hair color right now. The brown washed out. And this I want like toned. And I want the fresh extensions put in. I just want to like feel fresh, you know? Like, you, you girls get me when you get like your nails done or your spray tan. Like, you just feel fresh. So, I think, gosh, I got a spray tan. But, okay, these are going to heat up. And I'm going to put them in my hair. And I'm going to go do my makeup. And I'll like talk to you when I'm done with my makeup. I'm about to take them out. I just took out the hot rollers. Look how amazing that they look. Like, Honestly, I kind of, I literally put them in, did my makeup, and then took them out, and they literally look like I got a fresh blonde. This is third day hair, so I'm literally obsessed. Not sponsored, bought them off Amazon myself, but I'm obsessed. This is my first time ever doing them, and I feel like it turned out pretty good for my first time, like this side. All I did was I just put them in facing that way, there's a ton of them all around. I had to do two rounds because I have too much hair, I, like they wouldn't, I would need, I could either buy two packs, but they're kind of like $100 each, or I can do half my hair, let it fall, half my hair and let it fall. But if I wanted, I could buy another pack, and if you don't have extensions, I'm sure you could use one. But literally, I put them in, did my makeup, and then I just took them out, because normally I do my makeup, and then it takes me like 
30 minutes to do my hair and now it's like two and one like I'm literally done my makeup and my hair is done but then I just it took me like 20 minutes to do the back um, but look how they look they're just so voluminous and big and I'm not gonna hairspray it because I let them fall but if you want to see first time ever doing hot rollers hey guys um, I'm starting off the vlog for Paulina just like she instructed me to she told me to tell you guys we're in Dubai but not actually we're literally at Whole Foods um, Paulina forgot her utensils, so she had to like run back and get that. So now I'm here awkwardly alone. Ooh, the quality looks so crisp, so clean. Hi guys, we're at the Whole Foods, the classic, home. the home. Well, you when you're here, you feel connected. My roots are grounded. I feel spiritually aligned when I'm here. <laughs> I got my classic green and gold. Why is the quality like so good today? Did I change I this? It. You're all good. What did you do? I like. With the swirly thing, it's it's complicated. Oh my god, I'm like dying. Yeah, you're welcome. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Green glowing, but you're like shook. Um, a nice. Let's do a nice little hot. These are how my hair looks like for the hot roller. Can you do a mukbang? Mukbang. I would actually do it. Yeah. I would. Yeah. Guys, can you believe like this? Is how my hair. I literally put hot rollers in. Did my makeup. Let them go, and it looks like I got a blowout. When my hair was hot. greasy this morning. Okay. Um, can you um? Do a vegan mukbang. I actually will. So I got the potato variety, some vegan mashed potatoes, and some what is it? Sauteed yams. Um, yams everywhere. Mm, love yams. <laughs> love big yams. yam fan here. <laughs> big yam. Over here, big yam fan. Big yam fan. Your new Twitter bio, big yam fan. Oh my god. Next I got a lentil soup. I'm a big fan. Unreal. We'll do a little taste test. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Delicious. Let's try the yams. Oh, that's hot. It's a little brisk. <laughs> wow. Well, that was a good bite. Mm. I think you got a hair in your mouth. <laughs> Self love. Yeah, it's all protein. <laughs> Hi guys. Wow, the lighting is really bright. Did you whiten it a lot? I did it earlier. It's okay. I didn't like whiten it. I like moved the exposure up. It's quite bright, but it's okay. We're on Rodeo. I had to go exchange the thing for Gucci, and they didn't have the bracelet in the right size, so I just exchanged it for a, a belt. National outrage. It was an outrage. I was <laughs> shook, confused, so then I got chained a Gucci Paulina belt. Paulina had to be consoled by the sales assistant. She hugged me. She gave me a glass of champagne. She said, honey, it'll Get be it okay. Together. Get it together. In a good way. And we, we, we met, like I literally was like, remember I was like, I'm gonna find parking right on Rodeo. Look what I fucking did, bitch, I did. But um, oh my gosh. And this is a lot of drama <laughs> at one time. <laughs> Those people from the Starline tour just looking into my soul. Oh, love that. Oh. Oh, I like that girl's Valentino crossbody. Oh, I don't even know. It's like, like a cold breeze hits you and you shiver. <laughs> I got the belt in silver. Yeah. We liked the it. gold was canceled. Yeah, she was like, we only have it in the largest side. And okay, Shane wasn't texting me back, so I text him. It's an emergency. I call him eight times. It's an emergency. Shane, you have to text me back. It's an emergency. And then when I texted him, I said, what is your pants size? <laughs> Shane's a 32. In case, in case anyone's curious. Oh my god, I'm giving this person bougie ass parking. That's right, bitch. Right in front of Gucci. Oh, I love I love Frodeo. It's just so nice. Do you ever get like on Instagram it'll tell you someone accepted your follow request, but you literally never follow them? No, but I never I never really follow pe people on private. Because like Oh no, I'm not talking about private. Oh. I was talking about in general. Like it said this girl accepted my follow, but like but she said your follow she has to be on private because no, no I mean she was on private. Oh okay. But like I never requested her. I don't know if it's Who like a she? weird. I don't know. I I already blocked. Don't you hate when it gives you like people you might like? Well, I didn't block. I unfollowed. Um, I don't know. My story my before my camera freaked out. So like literally on my suggested on like Twitter and Instagram, I'd be like people you may like, and it's literally people from high school, and you're like no, no, canceled. Block all yeah. of them. Instead you of, you instead, press the X. Instead of people you may like, people you should block. That's yeah. what it should be called. Can we agree on that? Does yours do that too? It's literally the randomest people. It's, it's people I would never, ever, never talk ever to. Speak to. Never speak to. Even glance and like, at. Even my friends don't even follow them. 
type of exactly. People. So I don't know why it's just recommended. It's not even like someone maybe I used to follow them or something. It's really bizarre. Also, like funny story. If you guys watch my main channel, I made this story time like a year or two ago, being like he cheated on me and about this guy that we were like basically dating. I told all this story. Oh my god, honey. Oh my god, she's a girl. She just gave me such a look. Listen, honey. <laughs> um, just because we drive the same car. Should have went to Sugar Fina. Sun's out, buns out. They know you're here. I sun's out, buns out. That's what I mean. Like literally, I'm bun. I'm yes. out. Look, like, the sun is out. Why I, I, I always get start crying. <laughs> I love sugar peanut. I made my parents. So they didn't, I didn't know they had that one here or the one in Americana. And they're like, vegan. And not all of them. Well, not all. But they have but some. they have vegan options. Yeah, they do. And literally, like, I made my parents go to the one in Chicago. And, like, oh, my God. This guy almost, like, ran me over. And, yeah, literally, she was turning. What a dumb bitch. Okay, sorry. Oh. Honey. Oh. People are like people don't know how to drive. Tell like three stories at once. Yeah, I don't know what you're. Sorry. Okay, let's go. That there. made zero sense. Please comment okay. below if that made any sense. <laughs> there are two stories. One story. I love sugar feet. I didn't know they had them in LA because like they opened the one in Americana <laughs> recently. So my parents yeah. went and bought me some when they came. They flew. They brought them. Story number two. Why is this like look so pale? I can fix fix it though. Um. Story number two. So I'm like on Instagram, having a good day, scrolling, living, living looking at some nice dog photos. Dog uh, photos. Yeah, I saw a bunch of dogs. Is that what you call them? Mm, that's what I mm. call them. And I was just like, oh wow, what a beautiful oh, espresso. Love her. Had a beautiful day <laughs> scrolling. <laughs> so distracted. And then it's like people you may know. And the first recommendation was the boy who cheated on me with eight girls. Oh. Well, like eight, I exaggerate. Eight girls. <laughs> Not <laughs> one, but eight. <laughs> I exaggerate, but like basically. And I was like, Instagram, how dare you ruin my day like this? I exaggerate, not yeah. me. It probably was like one minute. So I tell it in the story. I like the story is so blurred, and I just created like an amnesia effect where I like kind of lie about what happened in my head. An amnesia effect. And so I'm just like, yeah, yeah. Uh, fun fact he watches my Instagram stories. Love my fans. <laughs> anyway. You're not real. Do you have any stories about high Paulina, school memories? where's Shane? Where's Shane? Do you get blocked where's every Shane? day? Where's Shane? Are your where's lips Shane? real? Are they real? <laughs> Why do you get blocked? Why can't you wash your 10 pounds of hair yourself? Like Are you even hours? vegan? You're fake vegan. Fake they have vegan. Panera Bread here? What? Oh. I didn't even know. Remember I'm... we traveled like four hours for Panera <laughs> Yeah, we did. That's a fight. That's a fight. Oh, that's a vibe, yeah, yeah, that's a vibe It's a vibe, it's a vibe That's a vibe, yeah, yeah, it's a vibe Am I a type? Pussy tight